You spot a man crouching between the shelves, just as he spots you. Bugger! Oh, Helm's orbs! I thought you were flaming fist. Well, down you go then. They'll be on us soon, so if you're looking to trade, you'd best be quick. Entrance is hidden behind the wardrobe. Here's the key. That's far enough. What's your business down here? Answer honestly and maybe we'll kill you clean. Well done. That's the lass who saved us from the Knolls. Let her in. You revealed our location. That tongue gets any looser, Rugen. I'll cut it out. Come down, then. Seems you're a friend of the family. That drink I promised will have to wait. We're moving out. The Elf Song's my local. Look me up if you're in the city. Good to see you. Killed any more beasts out there? I owe you one for saving my people. The Zentarim look out for their own. Even if it's Rugen. That's worth some coin. And my thanks. Our trader can show you some of our more exotic items now. But don't delay. This place is likely to be rubble soon. Someone kidnapped a duke. Right on our bloody doorstep. The Flaming Fist will need someone to blame. I don't plan on it being us. Well, don't you cut a fine figure. Want your portrait done? If you have the gold, my pet artist will make you a most heroical likeness. Let's say we're his patrons, yeah? Found him wandering the wilds alone. He needs protection. And if his paintings cover our costs, so much the better, eh? Are you looking to buy him? I'm open to offers, mate. Threats, not so much. These artsy tossers always have friends in high places. That's why they're valuable. But, yeah, might be we've drawn enough attention to this place. Take the money, bastard, if he means that much to you. That is crap would sell anyway. I can't say I've ever been bought before. How much did I fetch? No, don't tell me. There's nothing so depressing as learning one's true value. Well, you should at least know what you've paid for. I am the Oscar Fevras, at your service. A genuine pleasure. I'm in your debt, as is my patron. <clears throat> my betrothed, I should say. Assuming Lady Janeth still wishes to marry me after our little, um, falling out. You recall a recent scandal. A patriarch of Baldur's Gate who wished to marry a commoner. I did not run away. A date was never set. There were... complications. But before my fame, my patron, there was a... Uh, another woman. One I planned to spend my life with. But when Lady Janeth offered me a future, well, it felt only right to mention my past. Right, but unwise. I was forced to retreat into the countryside to paint and to clear my head, to choose, I suppose. Hmm? Oh, absolutely none. Uh, fame and wealth suit me very well, no doubt. And yet, I think of that first love, and I hesitate. <laughs> Likely I'm going mad. Regardless, 
We have more immediate concerns. Your reward once I've returned to the city, for one. Say, you... I don't suppose you could spare some coin, could you? Ease the discomforts of the road some... No coin? Mightily imprudent of you? I suppose I can endure the walk sober. Suffering has become an old friend, after all. Until Baldur's Gate, then. Look it, Claw! Sapper's here! Unless you've got another reason to be here. Feck sight! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Guess we're in with all sorts these days. If you're here to see Draw Ragslin, you'll want to let him and the lads know you're one of us. There's a party on. Celebrating a raid, we are. You'll need to wear our war colours. Nice to have this across the mug. Ought to do it. Them's the rules. You follow them now, or you follow them dead. What'll it be? Do it, or don't, you bloody ranger. I hope that was worth it, Daddy. It's hot in here. Sometimes you 
Sometimes the only way out is through. forward. irresistible. You recognize the overwhelming authority that you've used on others, only infinitely stronger. Your vision clouds, leaving you in a dark, featureless shadowscape, nothingness in every direction. Then there are three figures before you, an armored male elf exuding power and command, a handsome younger man with a quick, easy smile, and a pale young woman with even paler eyes. These are my chosen. They speak for me. Aid their search for the weapon, and you will be worthy to stand beside them in my presence. The visions fade and the voice falters as a strange energy swells around you. The many-sided artifact. Somehow you understand it's repelling the presence. My power grows. My forces gather. The reckoning draws near. That thing's shielding us. Incredible. Fresh disharmony, parents. We couldn't pick his humans. Oh, you got him good. And who are you? A half elf, thinking you rule the world. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Well, not us. Things are changing. We got the absolute on our side now. You better learn your place. Go on. Kiss more foot. Or I'll wipe that nasty look right off your pretty face. Well, go on. Give him a nibble. Goblin stares, mouth agape. Then he sets his jaw and falls to his knees. There. I've done it. Arrogant swine. What you standing here all dry for? Come here, have a drink. What should we toast to, eh? Guys! The 
musicians giving us a toast. You raise your glass and shout. To finding those looters and crushing them. Go on, drink up. That's it. Down the hatch. Need another drink. You poisoned us! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Snack! You're right. Whoever did this could be anywhere by now. Notice a shiver run through his feathered coat. Fear, a desperate longing for the safety of his nest. But his mother is gone, taken. All that's left are these creatures. The cub tilts his head. He's considering it, he runs away. Only time will tell if he'll reappear. In here, we're doing the absolutes work. State your business now. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Type, I suppose. Gonna have to be a bit more specific, though, mate. Absolute's got a few favourites around here. You here to see Priestess Gut, Boss Ragslin, or the Drow? <laughs> Audience is right. She's an uppity one, and no mistake, but she knows her business. She's in telling the war chiefs what's what. Next raid's gonna be a big un, I hear. Now here's somebody special. The Absolute has touched you, hasn't she? Priestess Gut needs to touch you too. Hold out your arm so I can mark your flesh. Maybe you don't need it. After all, you're special, ain't ya? Like me. She probes your mind, tangling your thoughts with hers. A familiar sensation. She too carries a parasite. Darkness seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man, one of the chosen. The vision dissolves away. You stand before the goblin priestess in the temple once again. Your minds brush against one another, but are swiftly parted. Don't want to get intimate in front of the novices. Fair enough. Got some weird shadows in your head. Maybe I can help with that. Us true souls gotta look out for one another. Of course. Don't want this rabble interfering with true soul business. Let's go to my chapel.
or to fight. And now you have one. Still breathing, despite everything. The dance macabre. for some bloody work.
Let's get this over with. Got it. 